Hi all. In this video, I am just going to explain about window handler. Actually, you know, right? Window handler is nothing but, for example, uh, but in this video, particularly, I am going to explain with the functions. I mean, normal procedure with the functions, how to write functions and call it as an object here inside this. I mean, public static void main. So here, I am going to just show you now. This is my website, tickwiki.com. Here, for example, I'm going to this. Actually, I'm explaining now what is actually Windows Handler. See, for example, if I'm clicking this free make any links, which is opened by another tab or window that is called New Window. Okay, uh, I think we can go now. So it's opening a new tab, and I think uh, in uh, Firefox driver it will open another window. So I'm going to show now. So drive chart. I'm sorry. Yes. Now driver dot get this URL. I'm gonna open this URL now. So once it opened, I mean I should click right. So we'll see now. Control F11 I pressed. And now if it clicks here now, right? So, what is the ID of this? I'm just closing this. I'm gonna get this ID here. I'm gonna change this ID now. Inspect. I think I mean no. I mean it's a blog, right? I have built this in the blog, so nothing will be shown, I guess. So, what I'm gonna make this? I'm gonna use this link text option now. Driver. What is that? Um, okay, right. To click the free make video download link. So drive to add. Um, always do some practice, okay? Uh, find element by link text here. That's a free make. If you want to use partial link. You can use your um, and use this syntax partial link text here. So now it's fine now, and not only that, I'm gonna take this. So yes, something wrong here. Okay, now it's done. Yeah, exactly. It's clicked now. So there is two windows, right? This is called and uh, like different window. Well, now I'm going to do this now. So for example, here I'm going to print all the window handlers now. Um, to get the window handler, each window has separate names. Okay, that based on that only you can, I mean, uh, navigate between this. You can switch into between two window handlers. That's what. Two window handlers right now. So here to get the window handler, I'm going to write this test case driver dot handle window one equal to. Uh, I'm sorry, this I did the mistake now. Actually, I need to. This is a uh, web element, right? No, this is a string. So I'm going to this as a string window handle one equal to driver chart get um, sorry find sorry driver dot window dot get Get, I'm sorry. Get window handle. Yeah, this is so it's gonna print now. So window this string I created right. So I'm just placing here to print exactly what is that. Control F11. Okay. 
seeing this is a window handler okay but this is the first one actually we have assigned it so it's it's printing and fetching the first one so what if you want to do this what if you want to do this i mean if you want to cache both windows switching both windows so i need this i mean the window id also i need this window id also so what i can do so it's called window handles it's come now Here I'm gonna do this now. Mm, same set handles. If you have any syntax error, that automatically will show now. So handle window handles driver dot get get window handles. Let's see, it's uh, some syntax error, I guess. Okay, because I need to I didn't set this as okay. Sorry, it will ask for syntax. Now I'm gonna print picture on all items. It's it's open. So I'm gonna close this first of all, and you can see now um, window handles. This time so convert F11. See, it's printed both. First time it printed the first window. For window handles, it's, it, it has given window handles separately. Even you can write a separate function to open this um, web driver and driver. For example, here I'm going to show you now uh, what is that? Class, um, class window open browser. So here I'm going to show this. I'm just placing this now here. So it's very easy. You know, wide box open. I'm going to give this down here. That's good. I guess both are same now. I have written as a function, but if you uh, if you're writing for functions separately, then you need to call it as like. See now how, how I'm gonna call this is an object now. Sorry, window browser. So this is a separate object I have created now. Here now window open browser. Okay, your variable name. Um, action. Um, for example, execution, okay, execution equal to new window open browser. I have created the object now. So, it's very easy now. I think I can give this also here. Last of a lot of mistakes I did, and I corrected it now with the separate functions. I write the I mean, uh, I did wrote the separate functions like void Firefox open. Here, you need to mention this web driver and mention the variable type in the functions. So, I'm I have created this object using this uh, class name, and I have created the object variable. So, I have just I mean, invoked from this object variable with this Firefox open method. And I also transferring this driver to this this driver to act with. So here it's clicking this one. I mean uh, after it has opened this link text it has it is clicking. And also in the in the driver it is I mean still it says the variable value. So I'm getting this get window handle first one and the second one it got printed. All the window handle got printed up. I mean printed out. Next thing how to switch it out. So here simple thing only you can do. Well, a lot of things I have opened, so I'm just closing now.
Okay, and then now. to switch over the other window okay here what I'm going to do is now just um, driver dot win uh, switch to dot right, method right dot here I'm gonna choose that what is that access exactly yes window here in the window is uh, which one you want window handle one because once this remake has been opened I need to switch back to this window handle one so I'm going in the simple see now I'm gonna press F11 first it will go to this actual link here it will click the free make link and it will come back to this techiwiki.com that is the function we have written now it clicked and opened see it's exactly it has clicked the clicked back to the same window it has opened this and then it clicked the url from here then this window has opened then then again it went back to this window so here that, that's it that's the same way you can I mean uh, mention the other window also name is window window to window handle to and you need to assign the variables of this get window handle handler the same way you need to do okay that's it uh, for this video and going forward I mean the next video I'm going to explain with the switch to method i mean how to use with the for loop and if loop that's it hope this video is very helpful thank you so much for watching my video please provide your comments and feedbacks in my video forms thank you so much bye